everyone, my name is Grace, and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is 2 by 2 Noah and the Flood. Let's read. The earth filled up with people, but they sent so much that God was sorry he had made them. He decided to send a flood to wash away everyone on earth. So God was so sorry to make the peoples because the people were sent so much. And he also decided to flood whole world. That means they have sent very much. There were, was a man named Noah who wasn't like the others. Noah loved God and obeyed him. God decided to spare Noah and his family from the flood. So, there was a man named Noah. They, their family were kind. God warned Noah about the flood. He told him to build an enorm enormous boat with a low roof, three desks, a window, a door, and an of this Noah built it. So God told Noah that God will flew whole world. So no God said to Noah to build a huge boat. Sorry. Sometimes it happens. Sorry, sometimes it happens. So Noah was obeyed. Noah obeyed God. Wow, it's a huge boat with a low roof, like just God has said to Noah. Question, who loved and obeyed God? Number one, a thief. Number two, uh, I think someone is teasing. Number three, Noah's family. The answer was Noah's family. God told Noah to collect two of every kind of animal, one male and one female. Then Noah, his family, and the animals went into the boat. God shut the door. So God said to Noah to take two pairs of animals. Because um, one female, one male, right? You can see there are female and male. <laughs> 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 God has helped Noah to collect two pairs of animals because like you can think like one Noah has brought a two sheep and he also brought a tiger and 
the tiger like ate the sheep, then it will be very difficult. But God has helped them. So God shut the door. It rained for 40 days and 40 nights. Water fell from the sky and rose from oceans and lakes. Even the tallest mountain disappeared. Banner the flew. So it rained for 40 nights and 40 days. Like you can think, there will be many water, right? Also, the tallest mountain disappeared from the flu. You can see it is going to disappear. Only this much has left. Question Did God tell Noah to take one each kind of animals to the ark? No. Two each kind of animals, one female and male, right? Meanwhile, Noah, his family, and the animals were safe in the boat, floating on the flow waters. God has not forgotten about Noah, not even for a moment. So, like, God was sin. Noah and he didn't forget that Noah and all the animals in the boat and Noah was saved. You can see every time when monkeys come, they're like giving bananas. Eh? The sheep is. God sent a wind to blow. The waters went down. The boats rested on the mountain. Arata. Noah sent out a dove. When it didn't return, she knew it was safe. So Noah has first time Noah has sent a dove, but no dove came back because there was nothing to leave. But the second time it didn't return. That means it was safe. You can see the waters has all dried. Sorry. Sorry to forget. Huh? When the ground was dry. God told them. <laughs> a minute. Sorry. When the ground was dry, God told them to come out. He put the rainbow in the sky as a promise that he will never flew the whole earth again. So dry ground appeared. You can see the ground and God has given the rainbow for a gift, a promise to not ever. Two by two. Oh, sorry. 
Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy it? And next time I will read another stories. Then let's see you next time. Bye!